All right, hello, FIDE parents and children, and welcome to this short video where I just want to go over a little something, a little more in depth about virtue. All right, um, before we go into the next uh, activity, all right, for this lesson, all right, which you you'll need to know what to, <laughs> what I'm talking about in order to understand the, the activity. All right, so what I want to talk about virtue is that there's different levels, all right, of obtaining virtue. All right. Um, so let's let's go over those right now. So we already know virtue is a habit of doing good, right? A disposition towards the good, all right? It's being able to do good consistently, promptly, easily, and with joy, all right? Um, so that's what virtue is, all right? That's the ultimate. That's the height, all right? You're doing good as a habit, all right? It's already become a habit, all right? But we don't get there overnight, all right? It's, there's steps towards it, all right? So there's four different ways... Uh, four different levels of obtaining virtue. All right, the first one is not even a virtue at all. All right, it's a vice. All right, which is the opposite of virtue. All right, it's a habit of doing bad. All right, um, that's when you just do bad without thinking about it. You just um, you you have no problem doing it. You know it's wrong, and you're like, I'm, I'm okay with doing it. All right, that's a vice. All right, but then there's the next level, which is incontinence. All right, so just a disclaimer: there's two different meanings for this word. All right. One is that you can't control yourself when you need to go to the bathroom. That is not this, all right? <laughs> this is a different meaning. Uh, the word incontinence um, in regards to virtue means uh, you know what is good, but you're so um, stuck in doing what's wrong that you, you still end up doing what's wrong. So it's, it's like, ah, I shouldn't eat you know, like a third bowl of ice cream because it's not good for me. But I can't control my desire for it, so I, I gave in, I gave into it and, and ate it. Right. So it's not being it's not being able to control your, your your desires, even though you know what the right thing to do is. But it's a better step than vice, right? Because vice is just I I know it's wrong and I'm gonna continue doing it. All right. This one is I know it's right and I want to do it's right, but I just can't get myself to do it. All right. All right. Then the third one is continence. All right. And continence means um in the philosophical term. All right. <laughs> means that I know what is uh, good and I'm doing it, but it's hard for me to do it, all right? It's not a habit yet. It's, it's like, going back to the ice cream example, it's like I know I shouldn't eat the third bowl of ice cream, but I really want to, but I'm going to control myself and not do it, which is good, all right? That's, that's, that's a great place to be in, all right? Um, it's, and when you're, when you're able to do that. Right, but it's not a habit yet, right? Because you can't do it easily. All right, it's not something that you're doing easily, promptly, and with joy. Right, you're not enjoying <laughs> doing what's right because you haven't learned to make it a habit yet. All right, so but you're in the right you're on the right path, all right? Because you you know it's right and you're doing what's right. It's just in your in your mind and in your heart ha hasn't um, caught up to it yet. All right, um, so you need to continue doing it more until it becomes a habit, which is then the virtue. All right. Um, so the virtue is when you're able to look at the ice cream and say, mm, I don't need it. And you can walk away. All right. And it's easy. You can do it with joy because you're like, I did the right thing. So I'm happy with that. Um, and that's what the virtue is. All right. Um, so we have vice again, let's just recap. Vice is habit habitually doing something wrong. Right. And knowing you're doing something wrong. Incontinence is, um, knowing what is good and wanting to do the good, but you're so stuck that you end up doing the wrong thing again, all right? Um, so it's giving into your emotions of doing the wrong thing, all right? But knowing what is good. Continence is knowing what is good, doing what is good, but in your heart, you're not, it's not easy, all right? It's not something that you have, have done easily because you have to force yourself to do it because you, you still want to do the, the thing that is not, is not good for you, all right? So that's continence. And then virtue is knowing what is good, doing what is good, and wanting to do what's good. All right, like you're you're able to do it with easily. Like this is not a big deal. I can do this. I'm I am free. All right, from my from my emotions. All right, I'm I'm able to I'm able to do this freely. All right, so know these things. It's important to know these things as you do your next activity. All right, that way you can understand a little bit more about what virtue is and how we can acquire it. All right, have a good day and God bless.